We are glad to welcome you on the Hard Reset YouTube channel and in this video, very short and simple one by the way, I'll show how you can connect the remote controller in Ant Aircraft if you have the EXO Ranger X7 Plus drone. So connecting those two together is a very very simple thing to do. Uh, they are somewhat paired from the box, from the factory, and it's enough to pair them once and interconnect them once, so they will be connected forever, and each time you will just switch them on, they will be automatically interconnected, so that's a very convenient uh, technology, should I say? No, not technology, just a very convenient uh, way of, well, doing things. Anyway, so once you took, or, well, took your drone out of the box, unfold and um, unbox everything, prepare everything the way you do that. So let me quickly fold the drone backwards so I can quickly show you that or the RC rather. So that's how you get the remote controller. Just move those antenna handles like that. Take out the antennas, then put those legs or I mean unfold those legs. The drone you will need to, uh, well, Unfold the legs of the drone. It's also a very simple thing to do. Just make sure that you uh, Start by unfolding the top legs the upper legs the ones that have those stands on them And then once you do that you will also be able to very easily unfold the bottom legs as well Just like that or when it comes to the top legs well, I need to fold it both of them to show you so as a so okay let me just uh, visually show you it will be way easier and quicker so here is the drone in its uh, assembled state in order to um, unassemble it well not unassemble just well unfold it and prepare it for flight take the upper leg unfold it and well repeat this process with the bottom leg as well very simple and easy Now, once everything is prepared, all that you gotta do is to switch on the RC by moving this toggle to the top. Then take your drone and also switch it on by pressing and holding the button at the back of its battery. Here it is, the, power, the drone's power button. So switch it on. And within a few seconds, those two should interconnect together automatically. So as you can clearly see, the RC now shows that both, well, I mean, it sees the drone since it shows the current state of its battery, so the connection went successful. As I've already said previously, the drone uh, should get automatically like interconnected since all those things are paired from the box. But if you have encountered any issues, you can just restart the drone, keep the RC enabled, restart the drone, switch it off by holding the power button like so. And then once it is shut down, just repeat the procedure and do that until, well, the drone, the aircraft and its remote controller will find one another. Anyway, as far as this particular video goes, that'll be it. So thanks for watching, thanks for your attention and bye-bye.